Hello and welcome to Enjoy a Monica. That was a little bit of a bend there. I'll be teaching out later on in this course. My name's Callum. But I want to thank, first of all, Joe Felisco, uh, one of the best harmonica players in the world and indeed best customizers in the world. I want to thank him for wishing me a happy anniversary. Thank you, Joe. I appreciate that. That means a lot. So in today's lesson, I'm not going to teach you one tune, but two tunes. I have to do it very carefully. I don't want to offend anybody. One is called Frere Jacques and the other one, because I'm feeling romantic, it's my anniversary. And the sun is out, so we're teaching you, you are my sunshine, that's quite appropriate. So if you're not on YouTube, get onto YouTube and watch the rest of this video. Thank you, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye for now. So hello and welcome to Enjoy Harmonica. I'm feeling a bit more comfortable now, a bit more relaxed. So during this uh, lesson, I'm going to be referring to an app uh, in Harmonica Easy Tabs, which I've actually featured in my uh, playlist recommendations on uh, Enjoy Harmonica. So uh, check it out. It's a, good, it's a good app, and I'm going to be referring to that and using that in this uh, demonstration. So. Uh, go into YouTube and uh, look at uh, recommendations and, oh, and enjoy them all again. So, let's go on to our first song, which is called Frere Jacques. And what I'm going to be doing today, I'm going to be using uh, this app just to ha uh, show you a new way of teaching. Uh, tell me what you think in the box below, if you like it or not. So this is uh, Frere Jacques for you, and I'll hold it up there so you can see the tabs at the same time, okay? Okay, so there we are, Frere Jacques. Now, there are, of course, a couple of things you could do to Frere Jacques tune to make it a little bit more interesting, personalise it a little bit more if you like. For example, in the second line where you're blowing uh, a five blow and then you're doing a five draw and then a long six blow, you can make the long six blow a bit more interesting. You know, you can add a tremolo in there or you can play it nice and slowly or... You know, you could do a little bit of a wobble on there. You could do what you like on there, really. So let's just try a couple of ideas, okay? That's, that's a couple of ideas you could do. Um, and on the last line there, where you go uh, four, three, four, you see, you could do it really fast and then the normal speed. Like this, for example. I did it the other way around actually. Or you could do it normal speed, and then the second time you do it, you do it really slowly, indicating the end of the song or tune. And of course, you adjust the volume like I did there as well, play it a little bit louder. So that's fair as Jack. I try and make it interesting, um, try and make it personal. And uh, the next tune we're going to be looking at now is um, You Are My Sunshine. So again, we're going to play it using the app. And uh, again, please tell me what you think of this method, teaching method down below. Maybe you think I'm being lazy. I hope not. I wouldn't, I wouldn't like, it, like you to think that about me. So, positive thoughts only, please, would be nice. Anyway, here we are. You Are My Sunshine. So there we are. So now, uh, there's a couple of things you can do in here, which I've mentioned before, actually. Um, but one thing I spotted, which you may like to try, is just the beginning, beginning of the song here. You've got a whole three, and it's the only whole three in the song, actually. 
and then you're blowing in that one, and the hole four you're blowing in, and then the hole four you're drawing on, and then you go into the, the what I call the body of the song. Okay. So why not just hold on to hole three, just a little bit longer. Okay. So for example, you could do this. Can you? So I did. I just held on to it a little, a beat, a beat maybe half a beat longer than uh, the the song requires. So I'll just show you that again. Maybe even a bit longer. Going to do. And so on. Okay. So it just adds a little bit more interest. Um, halfway through the song, there, you've got five and two sixes drawing in. So you could uh, articulate that a little bit more, can you? So use a yeah, articulate a bit more. Try and make that a bit more interesting. So in actual fact, that's the two songs I wanted to teach you. You are my sunshine, and uh, Fairy Jacker. Now, so that's it. Then two tunes today. Thank you very much. I hope you look at them and practice them, put into uh, practice what I've mentioned, and indeed uh, improve, continue to improve your harmonica playing. Now, in the next video, we're going to be looking at making your um, harmonica playing more interesting. How are you doing? And uh, so that's uh, really going to be a good lesson for you. You're going to learn lots of uh, tricks and uh, ideas on how to make your playing more interesting. We have discussed some of them briefly, but I'll go into them in a bit more detail next time. So I may not have mentioned this, but it's my anniversary. It's also my wife's anniversary. So if you want to uh, get us a little gift, then the greatest gift you could give really is to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And uh, if you want, if, if you feel really generous and kind towards me, then obviously you could share the channel on any social media you choose. Twitter is available, I understand. And, um, so there's uh, LinkedIn. You can do it on there as well if you like. And uh, just share me. Just share me and subscribe and like as many videos as you can. Call it an anniversary gift. That would be nice, wouldn't it? Anyway, thank you very much indeed for listening and watching. And uh, all the very best. Take care. Bye-bye.